So how can you make an effective testimonial video in 10 minutes or less? That's what this video is about. And whether you are an organization looking for testimonial videos or you've been asked to make a testimonial video, I want to give you some pointers here to, number one, save you time. Number two, help you come up with a video that's actually effective. The big problem with most testimonial videos, if it even gets done at all, is it's too generic, it's not focused enough. So for example, if someone sends me a video that says, TJ Walker is the greatest media trainer in the world, he's so articulate, demonstrates everything well, he's a genius, he's fantastic, you should hire him, that's pretty much completely worthless. All the person has done is said nice things about me, my prospects don't care about me. What they care about is themselves. So if you're asking someone to do a testimonial video or if you're making a testimonial video, the first thing you've got to do is talk about how you personally benefited. Focus on one thing and really describe it with passion. Then and only then do you want to pivot to the next point which is how you think other people who are similar to you could benefit. Stress benefits, benefits, benefits. Don't talk about in general how great someone is. So for example, when someone's doing a good testimonial video for me, they'll say something like, TJ Walker and Media Training Worldwide taught me how to be the best speaker I could possibly be. They've helped me take my business from $10 million in revenue a year to $100 million in revenue a year. If you're looking to really make sure you're the best speaker you can possibly be, you should hire TJ Walker and Media Training Worldwide. That's an example of an effective presentation testimonial. And that's what you can do. Now, a few other stumbling blocks people get into. They think, oh, I got to get it just right. So they write it up, and it's nice that you want to prepare, but they write a script, and then you can see them doing like this, their eyes are going back and forth, they sound robotic. Forget the script. If you want to make some notes to help prepare you, fine. But when you're giving the testimonial, you need to be looking either right at the camera or if someone's interviewing you, right at that person. You need to really come across as passionate and engaging. If you slip up on a word, that's fine. If you forget a point, that's fine. If you just stress one really tangible benefit to you and how you think other people can benefit from this product or service, it's going to be a strong, useful testimonial. A few other technical things. Don't worry about waiting for perfect studio production quality facilities. You can do this just with your own cell phone or an iPad or a laptop. The thing is you want to get it close enough to your face so your face dominates the screen. And if you're using a cell phone and no additional microphone, get it close enough to your mouth so that the audio is really clear. Just have a colleague or friend or family member stand up and hold the cell phone two feet in front of your face. If you're using your own laptop, put your laptop on a stack of books so that the camera is at your eye level. So it's not looking up your nose the whole time the way so many videos are when people make them at their desk. I hope these tips are helpful. Here's the final tip. Don't try to get it perfect in one take. Do a take. It should be about a minute. This should not go on and on and on and on. Do a take. Take a look at it. Do another one. Take a look at it. My recommendation, do five takes and take a look at each one. Then send the best one to the organization that's asked you for a testimonial. So if you do it once and watch it once, that's only two minutes, do five, that's 10 minutes. That's how I think you can do it in 10 minutes. Now, if you don't have testimonial videos for your business, I do think you're missing out. The whole world is going towards video. Anyone can write up a testimonial and just make up someone. You can say, oh, Bill Gates said I'm great. You know, Mark Zuckerberg said I was great, put a quote in. It's not nearly as authentic as an actual video. So I do recommend that you have video testimonials for any product, any service. For that matter, if you're a job hunter, I would attach these to your resume. 
Now, some of you have asked if you can do testimonial videos for me. Absolutely, but I do need you to follow these principles here. Just make it a minute. Don't read anything. Speak with some passion. Talk about how you personally benefited. And talk about how you think other people can benefit. So if you do one of those, if you're any one of the more than 10,000 clients I've worked with over the last 30 years, or if you're any one of the 100,000 online students I have from 169 countries, I'd love to get a testimonial video from you. But please follow these principles. Talk about how you've benefited, how you think other people can benefit and improve their own jobs, their own careers. And please send it to me, tj at tjwalker.com. Thanks.